Winning at first base. Shepard goes after this one. Rips it into right field. It is a base hit and it is well cut off by Massey. D'Antonio will be Holding forced to stop at third. And the Blue Sox will have runners in the corners with two out in the bottom of the eighth. A good rip by Shepard, but well played by Massey, who was at no doubles depth. He was deep enough to make sure that nothing was going to boot him and get to the wall. And he cut it off well. He still had plenty of work to do out there in right field. And he did it well. Shepard goes the other way. You see Massey really on his bike. D'Antonio crosses home plate. No time has been called. This is going to be an interesting decision. Nothing has been called. D'Antonio steals home. And the Blue Sox are in front. And gone will be Ryan Castile. He's been thrown from the game. And all blown up. He is sure that time was called and granted, and he is in the face of home plate umpire Bobby Crawford. Phil Dale, Phil Dale trying, to trying to keep him away. away he, he is not happy. Crawford. Ryan Castile. Trent D'Antonio steals home as everyone was standing around just watching. And home, and another one will there go here. Go. Pitch is gone. Pitcher is gone. Pitch is Trevor, Trevor Holder has been gone. thrown by Trent Thomas. Ejections left, right, and centre here at Blacktown tonight. These guys just have to stop. They've got to stop for the sake of their club. D'Antonio has stolen home Leave to give to the Blue manager. Sox a four to three lead. Leave it to their manager. Phil Dale is in trouble behind home plate of getting tossed out as well. He's in the face of Bobby Crawford. He's, He's gone. gone. Here's another one. Back it up to four. Four rejections for the night. And this is getting beyond a joke. Wow. Here we go. And who said baseball is a quiet game? Well, it is what you say and it is how you say it. The players really should have left it to Phil Dale in the first place to come out.